another day. Good morning. Good morning to the grind. Good morning out there to you, man. Those of you willing to work hard, use kind words, don't whine, uh, do your best, man. You know, that kind of stuff right there. Just the morning grind, grind out as your one-on-one podcast. Um, I'm Kijana Owens each and every Monday through Friday morning, 6 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Part of my daily method of operation is to get up and share some encouraging, motivating, but empowering kind of content to get the mind in the spirit of success because we get to. I'm, I'm, I'm super about the blessings that we get to um, tap into if we want to. It's available. So let's get it started. It's, it's a day to win. Uh, today, I, I really say we're going to be talking about connecting the dots to success with winners, uh, with like-minded winners, winners, other winners. How we do that? How we, how we attract the other people to think like we think, that want things or doing the things that we, we want to do in our lives? And being able to operate in the arenas that to help us win, if you will. Check it out. We get up in the morning, that means we're blessed. We get an opportunity to go to work, that's blessed. We get an opportunity to fix the problem, that's blessed. We get an opportunity to to be, that's blessed. So let's operate in in the blessings. Let's operate on on, on not wasting the blessings. So I like to get it started with, you know, waking up, uh, shaking off that laziness and, and, and doing the work that it takes well before you're asked to do the work that it takes because guess what later on the day you know a task that you need to do why don't you go ahead and get it done now be in front of the curve let's do it one of the biggest contradictions of massive success is when people go to their moms their dads their brothers sister boyfriend girlfriend they say listen one day the world's gonna know who i am one day i will have a ferrari the lambo the rolls the bentley the big house the cars the backyard with the big swimming pool and an elevator. I'm going to put the biggest party. I'm going to be a millionaire one day. Yet, instead of staying at the office on Friday night, you call your friends and you go party. Instead of waking up Saturday morning to go to the gym, you sleep until 10 o'clock. Instead of reading the book on Sundays, you kick back and watch movies all day long. The reality is very simple. Those who win big, they do four things right. They sleep, sweat, grind, repeat. And they do it over and over and over again until their dreams become a reality. If you can get through to doing things that you hate to do, on the other side is greatness. You gotta have the mentality to show up every day of your life, no matter what life throws at you. It's our responsibility to show up to the Coliseum of life, prepared for f***ing battle. I don't care what you're going through, what life's throwing at you, it's your responsibility to find your new 100%. You still must grind. I feel that most things I do, but still I grind. I don't want to do half the shit I do, but still I grind. And that one day, you see me on a dark alley, running at 1 o'clock in the morning, no one thing. I was grinding. Every single day when you wake up, you got two options. You can look at the clock and hit the snooze. You can look at that snooze button, boom. You can hit the snooze button and go back to bed and dream about what you want to have. Or... You can look at that snooze button, kick that clock, and get up and go pursue your dreams. You need to walk through the mud of life, guys, if you ever want to get to the higher ground. The higher ground is where you look in the mirror and you have respect that you went through the work, the sweat equity at all. And the end product is something you can travel, a legacy of life that you put your signature to that means something. You're not speaking hollow words. You're back in those motherfuckers up that. That's what lions do. Lions don't give up. Lions don't quit. Lions are us. That's what we do for a living. I still grind. I love to grind. If you're competing in one of my businesses, I'm going to kick your ass because I'm going to outgrind you. You have to be willing to work in places people don't see. While the other guy's sleeping, I'm working. While the other guy's eating, I'm working. There's a motherfucker out there who wants what you have. Who wants the position you are? Who wants the job you have? Who wants the wife that you have? Or the husband? There's someone out there hungry 
It was everything you can have. So make that a motivation for you. And mental toughness says, not only do I climb that doggone mountain, I enjoy climbing the mountain. I get a kick out the mountain. I get a kick out the weights. I get a kick out of fatigue. I get a kick out of the grind. I get a kick out of it. You take advantage of this opportunity. You let everything else go. You eat different. You study different. You practice different. We don't have forever. Let's not act like it. We're all going to die. And so I don't act like I'm going to live forever. So every opportunity I get, I murder it. Process driven. I love it. I'm about that life. I get up every morning at three o'clock. When I want to get up, when I don't. When I feel like it and I don't feel like why? Because I'm process driven. I'm not feelings driven. Champions are not feeling driven. Champions don't get up when they want to. And if we're going to be champions, process driven. Don't stop when you're tired. Stop when you're done. I mean, sometimes that, that's my mojo in the morning right there. Don't stop when you're tired. Stop when you're done. I, I, I like the energy in the morning. Mornings are better for me. Somebody asked me about the crowd. What time you go? Well, I'm, I'm not so strong in the evening. See how to find your fit. That's 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 the deal about the grind. You find your time. Find your fit. Find your your in natural ability. And work sometimes in your uncomfort uncomfortable zone. If you will, the evenings, late nights, get those. But generally, I'm, I'm ready to attack the morning, man, with big. I'm ready to attack the morning with, with uh, aggression, with you know, determination. You know, I'm ready to open up the can of opportunity the first thing in the morning because I say thank you. And ten toes hit the floor, and I'm on. That's what it takes. That, that's what I believe it takes. I, I just don't believe in finding ways to get out of stuff. But it's, it, it's much more powerful to find ways to get into things. But what are you getting into? So today we're talking about connecting those dots to success. To success. Connecting those dots to success with other like-minded people. Winners. Other like-minded winners, specifically. Who are they? The people like yourself. See, the deal is you guys are looking in the mirror. See, self-reflection is one of the most powerful deals in the world. We can always see the flaws in others. I get calls about how to, I can do this podcast better, uh, how I should place it, and, and who I should have on, and, and how come you don't have a million hits or whatever the case is. For one, I'm making no jokes. Uh, for two, it's very serious. So serious content is, is, is fluff, you know, it's, I was uh, cracking a whole bunch of jokes or talking about people, maybe, you know, but I'm talking about people making a difference. So that's a quiet, that's a quiet storm, but it's a storm that's necessary. So I'm about that life. This is the deal. The life that you're about, the life that you want for yourself, because what we have, I love it, is we all have a life. Because that's why you're able to see this. We all have a life. That's a fact. Some way, somehow, if you're listening or, or seeing this video, you you have a life lifestyle. That was how we choose to live. It. So, what what kind of lifestyle do we want? want? And you look in the mirror. You know who who has the lifestyle? Who has the 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 blueprint? Who has uh, what company? What business? What work? What idea? What concept has the vehicle? To help you produce an I the ideal life for you, not the ideal life for them or him or her, but for you. How would you like to live it? Knowing how you like to live it is important, first of all. Maybe you, you saw it from someone else. That's how it works. We're visual people. Maybe you heard it, maybe you read it, maybe you feel it, maybe you think it, whatever it is for you that you see an ideal life for you, whatever freedom, whatever, whatever that is. Ah, oh, putting in the effort. So you have we have to look in the mirror and say, well, what am I willing to do to live the life that I want to live? I got a life. I have the life. He woke us up. He got us going. He got an opportunity to take to make a choice, to take a chance, to change. We have the opportunity. And that's what we're talking about today. How do we connect with others that winners like ourselves uh see you out there thank you for tuning in absolutely uh, uh, hey 
it's just sharing some some serious in in the heart information it's my daily method of operation anyway so i'm already on for me not for anybody not not to beat anybody but yesterday i said that today i was gonna give a better effort to be better than i was yet yesterday at the end of the day wake up today and put my best foot forward to be better what else can you say about that uh, and, and, and at the end of that is results. So I'm going to share a little bit of something that it, it was a blessing to be a part of. Uh, I don't I don't know about you, but I believe in going in those rooms where you're invited, if you have the opportunity to learn and glean from people that are doing some things you want to do. And that's how you connect with like-minded people, like-minded winners, people that are thinking like you think or expanding the way you think. That's a that's a notion. How about people expanding the way you think? You may have a great concept, but you, but you can expand. Like I want to start a little donut shop, and the person asks you, "Why does it have to be a little donut shop?" Well, what do you mean? Well, how many donuts can you make? Well, I can make as many donuts as the the vat or the. the cooker or whatever it is will allow me to make. Well, what kind of uh, cooker do you have now? I got a 50 donut cooker. You make 50 donuts at a time, but you could operate a system that did 5,000 donuts at a time too. Yeah. So why does it have to be little? Mm. It's mindset. Let's talk about how we connect with people with mindset. So if you're in business, this is really for you. We network, we meet people. We have a filter of, of what the information that we're sharing, who we're looking to connect with. And I, I was just blessed and, and honored uh, this weekend to uh, meet, a, meet a young lady that was making such a difference that she, she's been around the world doing it. She's been able to uh, change lives doing it. And, and she's been able to open mindsets while doing it to include my own. I was offered the opportunity to sit and glean and then I had a chance to ask a few questions and say, you know, sitting in the front of the room where the million dollar seats are, right? So in my industry, I'm all about communication. I'm all about being able to uh, connect the dots, open doors for other people, but how to do so. How to do a better job at communicating. So this is uh, Ms. Michelle Shaw, Mr. Kelton Alexander uh, in a workshop that allows you to put yourself in a seven figure income with, you know, the work ethic and the tools that it takes. Stand by. Getting the C to be the A, A more frequent. Yep. That's correct, so you're taking pictures, you're showing the interaction with those. Yes. B, A, I may have a little bit more credibility or you got a, a stronger relationship. From, or they have the, the clients you're looking for. Yes. Okay. But the A's are too. So I don't want you to fool them with people who don't have your ideal client in the A's. Okay. Right. They can't get a gift. They can't go to an event. Uh-uh. Uh, unless they have access to your ideal client. Okay. Okay. So, so the, the B, yeah. is, they are the ideal client. Yep. They have access to their ideal client. Yes. Um, so you're looking to build a relationship with the A. Yes. Yes. And then the C. The C's are the same thing, right? Keeping them in the loop, and I know where it might go at all, but Absolutely. I want you to know you are an ideal client. Yes. You have the ability to be a client. Or they have access to your ideal access client. Access to the client. Absolutely. Yeah. And I just want you to know you're just sitting there all day. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
oh, I thought this would work for you, Ms. Dawn. Thank you so much. You've been an integral part of our business. We are so grateful for you. Okay. What you shared about the, the relationship really superseding, you know, financial compensation was very helpful. When it comes to directly to um, clients, um, shall I basically uh, practice the same principle where it's like I just offer great service and then accept whatever the referrals versus remunerating them? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, how many have you have you written commission checks to? So we're actually there's one we we have this one client I have this client who uh, is like the whale the you know uh, an MD and just but I realized he was not doing this to get compens- compensated he just liked yeah. the value given to his son mm-hmm. but for some reason mm-hmm. or maybe I have to like do some mm-hmm. kind of inner work like we all what do. is it, what is that all about we all do I right? hear you yeah we what is that all about. I, I offered him a care of four hundred dollars. I mean, you know, he, he he gladly received it. You know, it's like yeah, of course, I, you know, four four hundred dollars. You know, regardless of the package. But maybe in the in the future, I may just omit doing it. You know, yeah. would, would that be your suggestion? Just not absolutely. Okay. So your whales should get. Hi, my name is Kijana Owens. I am co-founder of Success Express Marketing Solutions. Our business is cultivating more business for your business. I want to tell you real quick about our program that is one of the most comprehensive business development uh, online marketing support programs out there, which is the BASP, B-A-S-P, Virtual Assistant Support Program. This system allows you to operate and run your business while we help monitor and help you cultivate more business for your business online. Contact us at 909-686-1698 and visit us online at successexpressmarketing.com. Look forward to helping you take your business to the next level. Success Express Marketing Solutions presents your virtual video podcast studio. Let the Success Express team help bring your podcasting dreams to life. Here's what we do. We help you come up with show ideas, design graphics for your show, set up your podcast studio, and run the back end of your show. So what do you do? Be ready for your show. Make sure your guests are ready. Log into the virtual studio. Turn your cameras on and go. Not sure you're ready to go live on a monthly or a weekly basis? You can get the Try Us Out Success Special. It's only $97 with free design setup. All you got to do is try us out and I guarantee you're going to want more. So get set up today with your virtual video podcast studio from Success Express Marketing Solutions. So go online to Success Express MKTG and we'll get you set up today. Sign up now and get our free ebook, Modern Podcasting, that'll teach you all the techniques you need to know to get your podcast started today. That was an amazing session. And if you, you got a little bit of it right there, and, uh, sharing how to continue to follow up, follow through, and, and what levels of communication as a business owner. If you're out there listening to this, uh, Rochelle Shaw, that was, that was some, some great information. Uh, Tess, I'm going to tear this up. Million dollar equation nine steps to building a million dollar business in three years or less. Hey, information is free application is where hey sign right that's pretty cool right there man you know get to meet some of the coolest people around the world uh, god has been amazing to me like that and connecting the kind of dots to success with other winners 
you know, other women. This we talking about, not not just you know people there. It, it's great. That's great. We want to connect with all, all of that, but what but other winners, like-minded winners. In fact, those are being in, you, you find yourself in an environment where what you're talking about is embraced, what you're talking about is celebrated, and what you're talking about maybe sometimes it, it just needs a little little fan to the fire. You know, you know, you fluff that fire, blow, you know, get the fire going. Somebody may add some some idea or, or some thought to, to what you are thinking of doing. And those environments are supportive. And you can also go into an environment where you share what you're thinking and what you're doing. And that environment can, you know, blow out your, your flame. What are you doing? Why would you do that? Who, well, that's crazy. And here's a here's big, big key in selecting how you receive information, how you accept the information you receive, and then how you apply the information that you've accepted that you have received. I'm going to share that with you here. Stand by because this, this, this is a breakthrough thought. For you. So receiving information from multiple sources about an activity, an idea, a concept, or an opportunity that you want to take hold of, you, you want to forge forward. So you're sharing information with anticipation of support, or just telling people what you're going to do, whatever it is, is this all of your personality. Sometimes telling people what we're going to do and then asking them, should we do it as well? What do you think? I want to go back to college, but I'm not quite sure. And depending on the environment you're in at that point, I'm going to stay right there. You're going to find out what, what room you're in. Most of the time we'll, we'll receive, well, it just depends. I'm not going to even say most of the time. Many times we may receive information that's inquisitive the feedback. Why are you doing it? Why would you do that? And you tried that before. That's crazy. And, and that, that information you receive right there, you could take it and you could say, well, yeah, I, lost, I, I, I didn't do it right before. I didn't succeed before. Or, or maybe it doesn't make sense to you, but I'm forging forward. Now that's one room. So it, it, those, that's one room of an environment of people uh, with mindsets may not have anything to do with them thinking you can't do it. They may love you and think that they're putting you in a, in a position of support and safety. And, and I'm going to tell you what the word is. It's comfortability. See, when you're comfortable, you're comfortable where you are, you know, what you're doing is okay, but what if it's not okay for you? So why would you listen to something that says be okay with what's not okay for you? That's one. Think about that. Now, you receive the information in another environment. Now, this environment is an environment that I consider to be a winning environment. This environment says, that's a, that idea, I like that idea. They, they may have input for you, and you may take it or not. This is how you receive it. You could do it like this, but see, that's empowering, not disempowering. See, the disempowering question is, well, what are you doing that for? An empowering question is the same thing. What are you doing that for? See, it's, it's, it's a voice inflection, it's reception, it's all of those things. You got to have your antenna to the tune that you want to hear that puts you in the best, best place to succeed and reach your goals. That's, that's it. That's the deal. He created you with an assignment that you have and other people might not even understand. It. So when you're in that room of support with those winners that they give you ways in which you can apply the thoughts you had, ways in which your thought makes sense or can make sense. You receive that and say, well, that room is a room I want to be in. That room is a room where you celebrate it and not merely tolerate it. See, some rooms are rooms where we have great friends and great family and, and we're able to embrace it. You got to be where you are. I mean, sometimes turn off your phone. Sometimes it's just that. Sometimes it's just potato salad. Sometimes it's just the game. Sometimes it's just that 
And sometimes, like, hey man, all gas, no brakes. So I'm in the all gas, no brakes room in general. I got some things I need to do in my life and pause for the calls and not, you know, uh, appropriate at the time. So operate in the timeliness of what you need to accomplish. You know, is it, hey man, I need to get this done. The tire's flat right now. I don't know. Connect with the people with like-minded winners that support where you're going. You have information of how to get there and may just have some vehicle available that you can tap into that puts you in alignment with what you want to do with your life. And that's what we're talking about today, connecting the dots to success with like-minded winners. That's what it's really all about. It's really all about being around people that enjoy each other, uh, live, love, laugh, learn, all those good things. You do it together. You fail, you flop, you win, whatever the case is. But if you're around people that say, you know what? We can do this. You know what you can do? You can do this. That's been the morning grind. Grindology 101 podcast this morning. Uh, shout out to my my guy, uh, Mr. Neil Shamor, my main man in the field, changing lives, making sure that not only he's taking care of his family, but he takes care of his community, takes care of his church. I wanted to send a shout out to you, man. Thank you there. And a, a major shout out to uh, my coaching mentor, uh, Mr. and Mrs. Eric Benson, having the opportunity to own and operate an online business while I do what I do, uh, live my life, serve and create uh, business opportunities for myself and, and the community and have a platform that I can introduce to others to say, you too can operate with your own frequency of why you want to operate a business in the number one industry in the world, travel while you do what you do. Makes sense to me. And I appreciate so much the honor just uh, uh, to receive uh, something that's very, very personal. She took the time out to uh, allow uh, for others to glean, be recognized, be uh, endorsed, you know, go where you celebrate it and not merely tolerate it. And I was able to uh, afford the opportunity to be in position to help our amazing team and be recognized by yourself and our team uh, as this year's team player. I appreciate it. I'm honored. I think that people do not honor the, just the mere fact to be considered for anything at all. No one has to consider you. I appreciate being uh, considered for the work that I've committed to doing to helping other people and to be in a room where the work that you bring to a team is celebrated, recognized, and, and shared amongst your, your peers and colleagues. I so appreciate um, everything that you uh, uh, allow for me to do. I appreciate everything that you uh, do for myself, my family, and our entire team team of champions around the world when you do not have to. I appreciate you. I do, I do, I do. I super appreciate you. Have an amazing day out there on purpose. If, if you want to win, why not? If you want to get it done, why not? It, it meant, I was asked a question. We'll go. Why do they sell $40 million yachts? The class. Everyone's thinking. You know what he said? Because people buy them. We're just not around the people buying them. Let's get around the people buying the, the little bitty jet. See what the little bitty jet to Dubai feels like. It's out there. People doing it. That means if they can do it, you can do it. If he can do it, we can do it. Let's do it. It's been the Morning Grind, Grind Dollars, you one-on-one podcast. I'm your guy, Humble, Kijana Owens. Thank you for tuning in, chiming in for your own success, get out there and make it happen. Have a good one.